This is fava beans. Fava beans are the only true bean that, that likes cool, wet soils. Most other beans need warm soils and don't take to waterlogged conditions very well. Uh, these are the nicest fava beans we've ever been able to grow. Uh, they're a cool season plants, so they really could have been planted much sooner than what they are in this plot. And they've weathered the summer really quite well. Uh, Dale, you want to show the pods there? Yeah, a very large seeded crop. Um, of course, they are used as human food. Um, they uh, really big seed and a lot of protein in both the seed and the plants. Very good nitrogen fixer, when, especially when it grows this well. Um, and as you can see from just the clusters of flowers that are still on this plant, even while there's pods, um, great pollinator value. Uh, if you can uh, see, there's a, even on a cool, wet day like this, there's a lot of beneficial insects flying around. There's a beneficial wasp right there. Uh, a, lot of, a lot of beneficial insects are highly attracted to this. Now this, I pulled up just one plant here. Look at the amount of biomass from this one plant. And uh, just really prolific producing here. You can see on the roots, uh, there was an earthworm. I think he fell off when I turned it over. But we've got good nodulation on this plant. Uh, yeah, there he is. We've got good nodulation on this plant. So if you can get the good nodulation, uh, it's an excellent nitrogen producer. Uh, the, the biggest downfall to fava beans right now is the seed size. They, they're so large, they don't mix well with other seeds and it's hard to get them to flow through your drill, especially when they're mixed with smaller seeds. Uh, we're currently working with several different breeders uh, trying to breed a small seeded fava bean variety uh, specifically for cover crops because I think it could be a tremendous uh, player in the cover crop game, especially being an early planted bean. We don't have access to that right now. Uh, so, you know, we're hoping that we get that with through the breeders here before too long. Under the right conditions, this is a tremendous producer, as you can see from this plant. Pretty tasty, too. Mm -hmm. <laughs>